Hey guys, what's up guys? What's up? How are you guys doing today? Uh, my name is Romeo, aka Romeo Fineboy in the building. I'm back again with another, with another, with another story. Guys, if it's the first time for you following me on my YouTube channel, guys, you're welcome. If you are my old subscribers, man, guys, you are amazing. I have not been I have not been uploading for a very long time now. So guys, I hope you bear with me because we're coming up with a lot, lot of more content for you. Beautiful one, good content. So guys, there's something that is really, really, really bothering me. You know, I I don't really understand. I don't really understand. I I just I read the news that Nadi Kanu was um, was adopted. <sighs> I take I, I look I take a look at the story. It was really somehow, man. But Nadi Kanu didn't do anything. He didn't do anything. Why must you arrest him? Why? Why? We have Boko Haram. Uh, this uh, so-called Fulani killing, killing clean our people, going to villages, clean our clean our our, our women, raping our women. Nobody arrest them. Nobody arrest them, but Nani Kanu is fighting. He's fighting for our right. Now they went and adopt him for what? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. The country is so called Nigeria. Me, I don't understand the country. The country is just like upside down. It's upside down. Why must you arrest somebody like that? Why? If you want, if you don't want that kind of thing to happen, make Nigeria okay. If you don't want anybody to be fighting, if you don't want anybody to uh, go for separation, you make the country all right. If you don't, if you don't want to make the country all right, people who wants to, people who wants to divorce, husband and wife who wants to divorce, husband and wife who wants to separate, make the country all right. If you, if the country is okay. Nobody will even think about of their voice or separation or whatever. Huh? But the country is not okay. It's not okay. And you you not you not do anything to make the country okay. What you're doing is just going around looking for who to arrest. This is this is really really bad. I saw that I was so I was so I was so pissed off. Believe me, there's a, there's, a, there's a lot of atrocity. Uh, Boko Haram, uh, Fulanis are doing right there. Nobody has brought them to book. Nobody has brought them to book. What is happening? I mean, do we have do, do we still have government, or do we still have police, or do we do we still have soldiers in that country? I don't understand. Nadi Kanu didn't do anything. Believe me, he didn't do anything. Please uh, leave this guy alone. For crying aloud, leave him alone. Huh? It's Boko Haram up there killing people, bombing different uh, 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 states, kidnapping people, kidnapping our girls, kidnapping our school girls. Nobody is doing anything about that. But look at this one that is okay. Now the country people are kind of taking advantage of the country, and um, and they are not they are not putting the country into a very into a very good shape. Now they want they want to divorce. They want to divorce. Simple. Give it to them. Over sixty years, people are suffering. Over 60 years now, people are suffering in the country. No food, no employment, everything is down. And you want people not to be hungry. And you want people to be smiling. Come on, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not gonna happen like that. I mean, if you want the country to, to move forward, if you want people to, to be happy, if you want people to not to think about their voice or separation, you put the country in order. You're not putting the country in, in. You're not putting the country in, in, in order, and you and you want peace. And people are dying every day. 
people are suffering. No food, no electricity. Food are skyrock. Food are skyrock. Everything is skyrock in the country. Dollars are naras are up. Sorry, dollars are down. Why naras are up? Things are very very expensive in the country right now. Put the country into a very good shape. Then you will see if people want to divorce or leave the country or divide the country into pieces. Why not do why not do the right thing instead of chasing chasing someone that does not do anything to you or that doesn't do that that doesn't even mean any harm to Nigerians? Go for those ones who are killing the who are who are who are killing people, who are killing your citizens every day. You see gunmen everywhere. Huh? You see gunmen everywhere killing people. You see, you see Fulanis everywhere. Huh? Why not go? Why not go, go? Why not go after that? I don't know where the country is heading to. Believe me, I don't know where the country is heading to. I don't know. Someone should, somebody should go to the comment section and tell me where the country is heading to. I don't know. What is wrong? So anybody can cannot hear his opinion. And nobody can hear his opinion. If anybody talks, you wants to arrest it. If anybody talks, you wants to arrest the person. If anybody talks, you wants to harass harass the person. What is the problem? What is the problem? The Fulani is there killing people. Boko Haram is there kidnapping, killing people. Nobody's talking. You're even giving them a amnesty. Come on. This is not, this is bad. This is bad. Huh? Nigerians are suffering. Nigerians are suffering. Nigerians are suffering. Nigeria needs help. Right now. Nigeria needs help. All, all you'll be thinking is about giving Nigeria a better road, better healthcare, good, good schools. There's no good school. There's no good road. There's nothing, nothing, nothing. That's what you should be thinking. Huh? People need good roads. People need electricity. People need water. All those things are not there and you want the country to be to be better and you want the, co the people to be happy how can they happen how can they be happy when the country is down it's not possible it's not possible the people will not be happy people people should come out and start talk and talk and talk so that they, they, they will stand up to their responsibility. I don't know the reason why you're doing this. I don't know. I don't know how how long have, are you going to are you going to continue doing this? I don't know how long. What is the problem? What is the problem with Nigeria? Especially the Nigerian government. What is the problem? Release Nadekan, release that man. He's doing that man is not the problem of Nigeria. Believe me, it's not the problem of Nigeria. Release him. Release him. It's not the problem of Nigeria. The problem of Nigeria is right there and nobody's seeing it. Everybody's turning bland, bland eyes. Boko Haram is, is the one destroying the country. Fulanese is the one that is destroying the country. Nobody's seeing that. Nobody's seeing that. Release that guy for crying aloud. Release that guy. He didn't do anything. Fulani is killing people. I don't understand. I don't understand. Sometimes I just feel like I don't know. I don't know what is wrong with that country. I just don't know. Believe me. I don't know. Anyway, I uh, thank you guys for for your time. Guys, if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, go straight and subscribe to my YouTube channel and also click on the notification bell 
anytime we we are we we are we are on live you will be the first to see us you'll be the first to see our video anytime we post new videos you will be the first to see our videos please go and subscribe please we love you and we'll continue giving you the best news give, giving you the best everything the best entertainment thank you and stay blessed